cave. Hello. Hello. Do you like oranges? Oh. Well, they sure like you. because I eat them. <laughs> They're delicate and sweet. There's so many people to help. Damn. Hi. Hi, Chad. Hello. Hey, hi, hello. What's up? Huh? Uh, so close, but still wrong. You need to use your imagination on that one. Uh, don't gloat. Can't we just drop it? But... What? Oh, what's all the ruckus about? You kids are being awfully loud in front of the shop. That's bad for business. Uh, oh, yes. Sorry. So spill it. <clears throat> Let's see you got you two flying off the handle. It's this. So picture you drew all the squares. Uh, has worked you? Uh, has he that worked up? What the hell? It's not a drawing, it's a crossword puzzle. A crossword yeah. puzzle? Yes, it's a puzzle with squares and grades in which you write answers to clues. Each letter of the answer has to fill in a designated square to solve the clue. With this puzzle, once the grids are completely filled, several letters are taken from specific grids and used to form one word or phrase at the end. <laughs> How about that, eh? Uh, that's what's hip, hap hip and happening these days? It does sound kind of fun. <sighs> Usually they are, but the puzzle Cocoon made is too hard. I'm so over, over it. it. Oh. oh, that would be me. I'm Kosaku. This is my girlfriend. She's a cook. Hi. <laughs> well, we'll see about that first part. Hello, nice to meet you. So, you two make puzzles and get each other to solve them? You must really like these things. Uh, yes, that's true, but... Huh? <laughs> I'm over it! I don't want to work on this stupid puzzle anymore! I'm happy you made this for me, but can I just give up? <laughs> no! Absolutely not! Why? Because you just can't quit. I'll help guide you to the answers. We can solve it together. You're sucking all the fun out of this right... Uh, the fun right out of this by being so intense, Cocoon. I don't want to do it. Mm. You have to, please. I said I don't want to anymore. Uh, sorry to intrude. Uh, have fun solving puzzles and fighting about it or whatever. Just keep it down, will you? Oh, oh yeah, sorry. Excuse me, may I have your name? Uh, uh I'm Majima. Majima-san, I have a huge favor to ask. May I have a moment? You say what? Right, Haiti? I'm like, this is so... Like, he's gonna propose. He's gonna propose mm -hmm. through it, and... Oh, so when you solve the puzzle, it becomes your proposal to Shizuku-chan. That's some real creative shit. Shh, Majima-san, keep your voice down. Why'd you make it so hard then, dude? Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Only the one who can solve my impossible crossword is worthy to be my waifu. That's, I, th I think, his, his angle. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm just trying to say he's real clever. Romantic, too, I guess. <laughs> oh, thank you. But I didn't count on her being so... stubborn that she can't solve a single clue. <sighs> Stubborn, yeah. Stubborn. Ah, that's a tough one. <sighs> yeah, that's where you come in, Majima-san. Can you help Shizuku solve the puzzle? Huh? You want me to help her solve it for you? Or for her? If I keep hounding her, she'll totally blow her lid and tear it up or something. Please. My whole future's riding on this. Can you help Shizuku-chan solve the puzzle so she can get to my proposal? Sure, okay. All right, sure, I'll help you. <laughs> you will? You're my hero! Okay, let me get this straight. All I gotta do is help the girl solve this puzzle and you're golden, right? Hi. Yes, if the puzzle questions are properly solved, my proposal will ultimately emerge. I need you to help make sure she gets it right. I get it. A proposal's a pretty big thing, ain't it? I'll pinch it for you. Thank you. Let's move it inside. Crab. To the crab place where they got lots of crabs and we are on an odd date. <laughs> Cocoon, you made this crossword puzzle way too hard. Can't we do something else? Don't, don't be so quick to give up. When you solve the puzzle, I'll treat you to the best crab they've got. Mm, I'd like that, actually, but there's no way I can solve this puzzle all by myself. It'll be okay. Majima-san here is an expert. He can help you with it. Right, Majima-san? Uh, like a wordsmith at a crossword forge. <laughs> 
Oh, really? That'd be so helpful. coco has been obsessed with this crossword thing. It's so weird. Oh. Mm. Can't say I blame him. He's got his whole future riding on this. Huh? huh? Oh! Oh! Let's start with the puzzle already solved. One down. Uh, okay. So, uh, so uh, what's one down? Uh, what's the clue? Um, one down. A dish made by boiling and crushing potatoes and often served with gravy is called blank potatoes. The blank is where the answer goes. Girl. Uh, -huh. uh back it up. What the hell's gravy? <laughs> it's a Western sauce made from juices of cooked meat. You know, the brown sauce they often serve with steaks and meat when it's served Western style. Oh, <laughs> oh that stuff. You really know your way around food, Shizuka chan. <laughs> yes. But boiled it and crushed potato dish that goes well with gravy? Mm, I can't picture it. Mm. From the number of squares, it looks like it's six letters long. Crushed. Sam. Smashed. Boil him. Smeagol. Okay. A dish made by boiling and crushing potatoes often served with gravy is called blank potatoes. The blanks being six letters long, it's... Hashed. Mushed. Mashed. See ya. Ain't it mashed? Oh, that sounds right. It's the creamy, mushy potatoes you get with steak. Majima-san, you're so fabulous. Mm, mm. Majima-san, you're on the ball. Yeah, I guess that has to be the answer. The only places that serve mushed potatoes are the ones that can't spell. Why didn't I know that? Like the Nian Cave. That's what you're hoping for? Yes, you're doing great. I think it's safe to fill in the squares then, Shizuka-chan. From square one down, mash. Okay, let's see. Mashed. M A S H E D. I wrote it down! She writes as if she's painting. Uh, all right, next clue. The next clue is What is the most popular snack serve of food served at movie theaters? Cocoon even left a note saying we shared some of the last movie we saw. Okay, and you couldn't get this one. Hmm. <sighs> I ain't been to a theater in ages, so I don't really know it's popular. Kind of a skimpy clue. I have to agree. But if you shared some the last time you saw a flick, do you remember what it was, Shizuka Chow? Mm. I do remember Cocoon buying some stuff at the counter, but what all was it? They asked him what size he wanted, and then. Huh? It comes in different sizes, huh? There are seven grids to fill out to be filled out this time. Okay, a seven letter snack food that's most popular at movie theaters, and it comes in different sizes. And it costs. Nudes! 18... <laughs> Nudes! You can get really big hot dogs, I guess. See ya. Ain't it popcorn? <gasps> oh, yes! That's right! It's popcorn! <laughs> yup, yup, that's it! Yes, popcorn has really taken off at movie theaters lately. Why didn't I remember that? Looks like we got it right. Yes, you're doing great. Please keep it up. Uh, Shizuka-chan, let's fill in the squares. P-O-P-C-O-R-N. That spells popcorn. Hot doggo. Okay, um, popcorn. P-O-P-O-K-A-R-N-N. Got it. I wrote it down. Uh. All right, bring on the next clue. The next clue is, a phone with a carrying strap that can be taken anywhere is sometimes called a blank phone. <clears throat> they really make phones you can put in bags or on your shoulder now. Uh, man, what a time, time to, to be, be alive. alive. What a time to be alive. <clears throat> it looks like a word that's eight letters long. A phone that you can carry around, huh? Didn't I see... That phone, a bag, uh, called a bag phone somewhere? That's too short. Is it? I'm totally lost here. A phone with a carrying strap that could be taken anywhere is called a blank phone. So the A letter word to fill in the blank is. Portable? Oh, shit. Oh, you thought it was gonna be easy. I assume backpack. But shoulder. Yeah, shoulder could work too. Backpack phone? Backpack phone? Actually, Chet's helping this one. It's eight letters. P-H-O-N-E. 
five letters. One, it's backpack phone. Shoulder. I don't know. Three? High tech? I think it's one. Three. Four. Well, I trust not. I can't. Uh -oh. Backpack. Baku Baku. Yeah. And backpack phone? Backpack phone! I see. That does sound very portable. That must be it. Uh, what? Oh, nine, nine. Now you say you can't remember? And backpacks have straps too, right, Majimi san? Uh, it, yeah, two of them. And it's a perfect fit at eight letters long. I think we got this one in the bag. Yeah. Wait, but, uh. Fill those boxes, Shizuka chan. B A C K P A C K. Hi. Okay, um. Backpack. Uh oh. That's not pencil, that's pen, and she's writing it like five times. Back, 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 back. No, that's wrong! It is. It is. Huh? That's wrong! Uh, the clue said A carrying strap, not two. Why would you carry a phone on your back? It's not an army field radio! Oh, uh, I guess not. Oh, so you're saying... I can see why she wasn't having fun with this. No. It's not a backpack! It's shoulder! You can wear these phones over your shoulder, so of course it's where the name comes from! It's called a shoulder phone! So, so, so that means... Just write shoulder in the blank squares. Oh, you're way too intense, Cocoon, but fine. Shoulder phone? Bag phone? Why two names? I wrote it down. Good. On the on to the next one. Maybe you shouldn't marry him. No, <laughs> don't marry him. Don't marry him. <laughs> this is a cute idea that is being taken way too seriously. Go to counseling, then marry him. Majima san, we're almost done. The next one is the last clue. <laughs> yeah? yeah. Uh, let's do this. Okay, I'll read the last clue. This term is used to categorize the faces of men. A man with a typically plain Japanese or with plain Japanese features is called a blank blank face. The opposite is called a sauce face. The hell is that? Teenager slang? Oh, now I'm screwed. Mm, I think the two blanks are where the answer goes. It must be two words. There's room for eight letters in all. Okay, so the opposite of sauce face m must mean that it's got something to do with a flavor or a condiment, right? Uh. Well, that sounds very possible. If a sauce face describes a face that's rugged and foreign, then this would be softer. Okay, a term used to describe the face of a plain Japanese guy, and it's two words followed by face. The opposite is sauce face, so the two words are... Miso soup face. Soy sauce face? <laughs> well, it's definitely not soy sauce face. Salt. I gotta think it's miso soup face. Miso soup. Miso soup. What does chat think? It can't be salt free. Oh, Master Crazy says oh, soy sauce face. Easy. Soy too. What? But they said it's eight letters. That's eight letters. I am very sure it's soy. That's eight letters. Soy. Oh shit! It and is. And then oas. Oh my bad. That was nine. See ya. Ain't it soy sauce? <gasps> oh, so you're saying it should be the soy sauce face? <laughs> yes. Yes. Soy sauce is definitely less rich and thick than like barbecue sauce, for example. Yes. So it is. Majimisan, you're awesome and attractive. It's a seasoning and it's a sauce. It has to be soy sauce. Is that right? Yes. You're fucking lucky. She's a good job. Gotta write that down. Soy sauce, okay? Yep. Um, soy sauce. S O Y S A U C E. You wrote it down. Hmm? Uh, let's see. Is that it for the clues? Yes! Oh, thank God, it's finally done! Wait, wait, it's not finished yet. There's one last thing you gotta do. Do you see the circles on the puzzle? You've gotta use the circle letters to form a word. 
right. Let's see. It says, let's blank. I guess the blank is the word you get from the letter circle in the puzzle, so it's five letters. From mashed, I get M-A. From popcorn, I get the letter R. From shoulder, I get another R. And from soy sauce, the letter Y. Okay. Now just write those letters in the blanks and read the whole thing out loud. Let's marry? Yes, of course I will. I thought you'd never ask. Cocoon, what's this? We're married now. That's how I feel about you. I've been wanting to say those words for a long time now, but I could never work up the courage. But I thought, maybe. Just maybe. Putting them in a crossword puzzle would help me. And that's why I was so adamant about you solving this one. But I made it too hard. I'm sorry. I just wanted to... Never mind. Coco. So, um... Yeah. What you read there is how I feel about you, shizuku -chan. Do you... Do you have an answer for my hardness? Not until you say it. Oh, shit! Shizuku, don't date no cowards! He's gotta say it! Hmm? That's right. Kokun, I want you to look me in the eyes and ask it. Ko! Ko, come on! Sorry. Shizuku-chan, will you marry me? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. Yes! <laughs> really? You will? Sweet! Yes! How hard was that? I wish you had just said it instead of putting me through all this, you idiot. I'm sorry, I didn't think you'd have so much trouble solving it. I did it on purpose, you know. I wanted you to say it. Aww. Wait, what? Forget it. Congrats, Kosaku and Shizuku. Wow. Maybe they deserve each other. Majima-san, I can't possibly thank you enough, but please, take this. Five tourmalines? <laughs> oh. Majima-san, you sure know your way around crossword puzzles. You breezed right through it. You you really new at these? <laughs> yep, first time. It was pretty fun, though. You gotta put together another one of these for me sometime. Yeah. Oh, I don't think there'll be another one. My crossword puzzle-making days are over. From now on, if I need to convey my feelings, I'll say it in my own words. Cocoon. <laughs> uh, you're sappier than a tree, Cocoon. But good for you. Well, we'll be going now. Thank you, Majima-san. Thank you so much. We're gonna be happy together, heart. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, no doubt. I hope she writes her wedding vows in a crossword puzzle. I bet those two would have ended up together no matter what I did. But he's right. If you want to say something, you gotta say it in your own words. Your own words are what get you through life's toughest spots. Even when you gotta cross words. Cross words. <laughs> High, <laughs> High five, brain. brain. <laughs> uh, oh, fuck. Damn it. Time to be moving along. Giant enemy crab! Out of my way, there's a small girl who needs my help! I got things to play! Talking about citrus bagels, chat, but can we see why Nyani loves a thickly stud muffin bathed in cinnamon toast crunch? Yes, yes we can. Jackson! We absolutely can. <laughs> Thank you, Jackson. I'm gonna play some things. Finished Professor Layton and the Azran Legacy last Ooh, night. Oh, congrats! Amazing end the prequel trilogy. It had me crying so hard last night. Hashtag Luke Protec. Nice. What would there be to protect me from? Hi. Hi! Hi. Hello. Hey. Hi. How's it going? He's an angry guy. He doesn't need Yans to get high. But he... Writes comments online. Nice. Nice. I hope you guys get to play Layton again soon. Eventually, over time. Hashtag Luke Protection Squad. Maybe. Yay! Maybe. I kind of am looking forward to when DGS gets finally done. I was feeling Phoenixy Righty Ooh. the other day, and I was like, you know what? Phoenixy Righty. Thank you, PK. Take a chill pill guy, and this is coming from me lol. Hey, 
angry. You yeah. don't. Crosswords are serious oh, business. Crosswords are serious. Serious business. He's hey. the protag of the crossword anime. Hey, kiddo. Where's your mom? Are you lost? Do you want to be girl? You should be girl. No? Okay. No, I'm not. No? Why don't you stand it around all by yourself for then, huh? No reason. <sighs> oh, what's with this kid? She's doing it right not talking to strangers, but it's dangerous here. I better send her packing. Listen, why don't you hightail it back to your mom instead of loafing around out here? This ain't no place for kids. Okay. What's with you then, you little scamp? Kinda looks like she had something to say. Still, she ain't lost and ought to make it home okay. I just hope there's no troublemakers looking about. Can you buy crossword puzzles at the Kinbini? Oh, hey, oh. Hey, check it out, a little kid all by her lonesome. Eh, she ain't old enough to hustle. Keep your eyes peeled, would you? Gross. <sighs> no, fool. Grab the kid, shake down the parents. Easy come, easy go. Pretty smart. There'll be some nice cash in there. Let's go. Ah, <sighs> oh, here we go. Ah, she's fine. Oh, look gonna... at this! This is way more interesting! <laughs> wow! What a time to be alive! Pum, pum, pum. There I... was a kid, they took a nap. Da, 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 da. Got something real nice for you, little girl. Come over here. I don't wanna. You little fucking brat. You're coming one way or the other, way. Oh no, leave me alone. See what I tell you. Ugh. Who the hell are you? You're her old man? Uh, nobody special. Just looking out for a stranger. Huh? Stranger? Then you're minding your own business. Don't go getting any ideas and we'll make sure you regret it. Next time you ought to take my advice and head straight home, little one. This is a dangerous town full of scumbags. Uh, scumbags? Nobody calls me scum. I just kidnap children and then make their parents pay for them to get them back and uh, the, the older ones hustle or some shit. A scum? Yeah, I guess you're right, actually. <laughs> Never thought about that. It does sound kind of like a scummy uh, thing to do. It does sound like a scummy thing to do. Oh, wow. You actually knifed me. <laughs> I'm actually trash, not scum, Nora says. Oh, my God. I'm trying to do heat actions and it's causing me so much grief. Come on. Oh, should we buy pumpkins? Shove pumpkins in their mouths? If only. Oh! Ah. You still want more? Oh wow, that sucks. No, Majima! A baseball bat is too big to use in the narrow streets! You have to use the short <laughs> sword. Goblin duck. God, look, we're sorry! Give me a break! Good for nothing, losers. Um, thanks, sir. Sir, I'm only 24, you know. Really? Damn. You gotta unfurl that brow. It's adding like 10 years on you. <sighs> anyway, as I was saying, why don't you head on home? <sighs> okay. Something wrong? You and your mom fighting? Uh, no. And what's up? The doll. Huh? Red chestnut the squirrel. 
Just that's not the squirrel. You mean that red squirrel prize in the UFO catcher? Yeah. Oh, you want that? Yeah. I'm sure your dad'll buy you one if you ask nice. What? I don't have a dad. Well, that sounds like your problem. <laughs> oh. oh. I'm sorry, Scamp. Oh, it's okay. I'm fine. Still, no point hanging around here. You can't get it yourself, can you? It's okay. You don't need it. It's so cute, I just like to look at it. Aww. Yeah. <laughs> You're a strange kid. Alright, I gotta get going. Okay. Friendship with the doll girl. You got to know the doll girl. Interacting with her will gradually fill the friendship gauge. You can check the stats, the gauge thing. Build your friendship and see what happens. Red chestnut the squirrel doll, huh? Can't have her standing out here all day. So if I grab her one, maybe I'll give it to her. What? You still staring at that chestnut the squirrel doll? Huh? Oh, yeah, I am. I have one of those red chestnut the squirrel dolls now. Maybe I ought to give it to her. Absolutely not, and break up the squirrel couple? Yeah, okay, fine. Ah, fine. Here. Chestnut the squirrel red. Wow! It's a red chestnut the squirrel! Oh, it's adorable! Yeah, well, it ain't exactly my thing, so why don't you just keep it? besides my mom before. Oh. Best day ever! That's so. Well, I'm glad you like it. Now, will you get on home? Uh, yeah, I gotta tell my mom about it. Thanks, sir. Bye! <laughs> Boy, little scamp's a handful. But it feels kind of nice to make her day like that. What? There it is. If I go in and out, will she be back there? <laughs> like... It ain't my thing, says the man with three bun chants on his person. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it, it's that girl from the other day. And by the other day, I mean five seconds ago. You back, kiddo? I told you it's dangerous to hang around here alone. Hey, sir. How about you drop the sir thing now, huh? Now, what's got you hanging around here? Come on now. Speak up when someone asks you a question. Chestnut the squirrel dog. Oh, I guess we should reunite them. What? Now it's the blue one that got, you got your eyes on? Yeah, the blue chestnut is super cute too. Well, if you say so. Uh, so you got your heart set on that now? Uh, no. You got me one the other day and I'm happy to have it. I'm not greedy. I don't have a daddy. And my mommy's at work all the time and she says there's no money for frivolous things. <laughs> so I just wanted to come and look at it. Um, well, you gotta head home soon. I don't want your mom to worry about you, uh, do you? Uh, I know. I just want to look at it a bit longer and then I'll go home. Every second you stick around this part of town, you risk too much, kiddo. Uh, the only way to keep her safe is to grab that blue squirrel when I get the chance. Hey, I told you it's dangerous hanging around here. Get your health self home. Quick's down now. It looks like she Oh, I don't have one. I've only got the other one. You only got Jumbo. Fribolus is the cutest thing. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, they have Zandals. There they are. There they are. I don't see them. Is there oh there's only one tiny one. Or is there two tiny no, ones? There's two tiny ones, and one big one in the back. Da 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 da. Dun, dun, dun. Easy mode. He's so proud of himself, too. What She's selling him on the side for profit. I don't <laughs> trust her. <laughs> Zaya, that's amazing. Oh, shit. Pikachu evolved into Nut Squirrel. <laughs> oh.
I like that green sleeves just plays. It's just green sleeves. <clears throat> Look, here's a blue chestnut the squirrel. Wow, it's a blue chestnut the squirrel. You take care of him. Squirrels ain't my thing. Really? I can't believe it. Everyone's going to be so jealous when they show them at school tomorrow. Jealous of that little thing. Uh, yeah, the other kids always talk about how their daddies are buying them dolls and they show them to each other. Mm. I get left out whenever that happens, but, but now I have something to talk about. Oh, I'm glad for you, scamp. But I ain't your daddy. Yet. Uh, no. You wouldn't really know, but don't daddies buy things for kids? Uh, I suppose it depends, but that's a dad thing, yeah? I knew it. So, if I did have a daddy, he'd be kind of like you, right? Aww. Huh? Uh, how'd you figure? Because you gave me two dolls. And saved you from those men. Uh, I, I did, but... You look old enough to be a daddy, so you're just like a daddy to me. How old is this kid think I am? Uh, I wish you could be my real daddy, sir. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, you, you know that ain't gonna happen, right? Well, can I just call you daddy now? Hmm. I say, well, I say, what? Oh, you don't want me to. Yeah, my choices are sir or daddy, huh? I ain't too fond of either, but what's the right play here? Let her use daddy. <sighs> uh, call me whatever you like. I don't care. Really? Oh, Aww. yay! I like daddy best then. Aww. I'm getting some mixed feelings here, kiddo. <laughs> you best get back to your mom. Uh, okay. Bye, daddy. <laughs> no. Uh, you take care on your way home. Her mom is going to kill us. When you accidentally adopt a child, I've yeah. been there. <laughs> Mom, I got a new daddy. Yeah. Damn it, kid, you have an addiction. It's wholesome, but also kind of weird, it's true. I don't think I'd let any girl call me daddy. Not Fast great. forward two years when your daughter is born. <laughs> oh. No. No girl shall call it's me daddy. Father. You call yeah, you call me father. Father Sama. <laughs> Dad, it's fucking weird. I'm 23. That's Father Sama to you. I'm not gonna do it. Oh, uh, which one is it now? <laughs> uh, you really got an eye for these dolls, don't you? It's just the pink bunch hand looks so pretty. Yeah, we got it. Pretty or not, did I tell you how dangerous this area you can get? You don't look for trouble, are you? No, I'm sorry. <sighs> Here we go again. The pink bunch hand, huh? I'll see if I can get her one. What? You still staring at that bunch hand doll? those pink bun chan dolls now. Maybe I, I ought to give it to her. Here you go. A bouncy little bun chan. Aww. Bun chan the Java Sparrow pink. Wow! The real pink bun chan. Oh, thank you so much. You have no fucking idea how hard that was to get. Say, how come you like dolls so much? Oh, I'm just all alone when I'm at home. Oh. Having my squirrels around feels like I have friends over. <laughs> Like dolls are the best. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. Uh, and now Bunchan gets to join the family. Oh, thanks for everything, Daddy. I'm gonna take such good care of them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, now off you go, back to your uh, mom. Okay. Bye bye. Maybe now the tea party's complete. No reason for her to hang around here anymore. I hope. Not yet. Not yet. Clay, she watched through the window, yeah. 
Now it's the regular Bun Chan, right? It's Jumbo and all Bun I'm, Chan. And all I'm left with is two. <laughs> Aww. Huh? What the? That's your little girl, Majima. It's that doll girl bawling her eyes out. <laughs> oh, what's the matter, Scamp? Oh. Huh? huh? What is this? The doll I gave you got all messed up. Who did this? I want names. Oh. My, my mom. My, my, my mom is getting killed. Killed. What? The scary matter came. My money showed up. But this time, they took her away. They made this, this, this to your doll, huh? Do you have any idea of where they took your mom? Down by the river, I think. All right. Come on, kiddo. We gotta bust a move. Yeah, this this escalated very fast. Yeah, outside. I was expecting just to give a regular bun chan over. Oh, stop it! I already paid you back everything I borrowed. What are you talking about, you dozy cow? We lent you a million yen, remember? But but I paid it all back by the due date. Huh? Are you really that dense? You ain't paid a drop of the interest yet, yar. <laughs> by my calculations, that's about thirteen million yen left to pay, and we want it back now. Thirteen million? Uh, I could never. Yeah, well, I guess that leaves us no choice then. You're young enough, still. Should earn us plenty of cash out on the street. No. No. And I know plenty of sickos who pay top dollar for- Oh, gross. What? what? You can't. Oh, the term of the deal. You work for us every last yen is paid back, you got it? Brat's gonna fetch a pretty price, too. Ugh. Leave her alone! My daughter, she's the only family I have left. Please, at least spare her. Please. I know you guys said that Kitty has never killed anybody, but I'm very confident that Majima has and will. I think he's going to. <laughs> Hey, get her out of here. The kid will be out front of that arcade like usual. I'll go hey. scoop her up. Gar, gotcha. Oh, no need oh. for that. Huh? Huh? Gar, who are you? <laughs> you here to give us lip about the way we do business, are you? Huh? Yeah. I don't give a flying shit about your business. You can do whatever the hell you want. Then you're smarter than you look. How about you leave the kid and scram then? Yeah, that ain't gonna happen. See, there's two types of people in this world that really Aww. set me off. Aww. Dipshits who tear up dolls that I went through a lot of trouble to get a hold of, and fuckwits who prey on defenseless women because it makes them feel big. Well, what happens when you check both of those boxes? You fit both those bills, asshole! What? You motherfucker! Yar, you gotta screw loose, you skinny runt, cause you're begging to get your neck broke. <sighs> Shut your mouth and put up your fist so I can hurry up and beat the shit out of you. Fuckwits. <laughs> get him! <laughs> and home run! Oh, you're unfortunate enough to still be alive. I'm so sorry for you. Oh, uh -oh. that's weird. He's got an aura, a menacing aura. Nope, he's dead. Ole. I don't know what circle does. <laughs> Throw him in the river, yeah. Hey, I ain't done with you yet. I still gotta tear you up as badly as you tore up that poor doll. <laughs> Have mercy. Ah, oh, come on. I was just getting to the fun part. Daddy! Hey, you all right? Dad? Oh, this is awkward. I'm confident she still would have called us daddy even if we said Majima son. Uh, yeah, this is the man who bought me all those dolls, Mommy. I call him Daddy. <laughs> oh, so that was you? My daughter talks about you all the time. Um... I don't suppose I could ask your name. It's Daddy-san. Sure. It's Majima. Oh. Majima-san, you've done so much for us. I, 
I don't know how to thank you. 13 million yen sounds. <laughs> uh, it was nothing, really. This is a little a token of our appreciation. Please accept it. Oh, a security wallet. Wow. Uh, I appreciate it, lady. Daddy, I'm oh. sorry. Huh? Oh, what's wrong, Scamp? Oh. I told you I'd take good care of the dolls, but please don't be mad at me. Why would I be mad at you? It ain't your fault. Don't even sweat it. But... Listen. Even with its eyes coming off and cuts all over, like, it, it ain't like it's dead. Its heart's still beating. I can feel it. Really? Yeah. Heck, I'm living proof, ain't I? Aww. Take a look. One eye's gone, but I'm doing just fine. <laughs> yeah, you're right. When Bunchan got all messed up, he didn't throw it away, right? He's still clutching it close. It looks pretty happy about that, if you ask me. Really? I'm gonna fix him up and keep him safe then. Yeah, you do that. Well, I better get going. Thank you for everything, Majima-san. Daddy, huh? Befriend doll girl. It's got a nice ring to it. That's sweet. Okay, so here's the deal. Yeah. Majima's gonna marry Kiryu, uh, and Nishiki's gonna die, and then we're gonna open an orphanage in his name. And, and then we're gonna be, uh... Huh? Parents. Hey, who? We've run out of eggs again. You were supposed to go out shopping. Oh, sorry. A weapons customer stopped me to complain, and I guess I got distracted. Good. Uh, you guys seem busy. You want me to come back later? Oh, Majima-san. How are you? I am sorry you had to see that. <laughs> Hello, Majima-san. Anyway, back to eggs. Say who? <laughs> Best price is at market next town over. You're relentless, all right. I'll be back with them soon. Oh, oh. while you're there, can you look for equipment for Majima-san, too? What? But I've never done agent work. You want fei -Hu to do what? Hmm. We told you about agents, like treasure hunters, but find equipment and parts. fei -Hu, go find good things for Majima-san. Make lots of money. Oh. <sighs> Why use many word when few word do trick? Is this work really such good money? Uh, what do you do exactly? This is what we do, Majima-san. Oh, wow. Whoa. I can play them things! Oh yay, more Yakuza streams time to simp for Kuryu's bountiful chest weights. It's Majima hours now. Oh, okay, cool, I guess. Monadoof! Thank you. I'm gonna play, try to play this one, but I think it's not gonna work. It didn't. Um, Monadoof! Jokes aside, I love Majima. <laughs> Hope you guys like him. Like him? Uh, I love him. He's amazing. I don't I, know if you got that from my fanfic that I'm writing. Sorry that Nishiki has to die in it. It's just the, like, naming an orphanage after your bro that you grew up in an orphanage with. Ah! Uh, you know? It's just how it has to be. But don't worry, Nishi's gonna have a child part that I've have it all figured out. A new countdown site has opened up for the world ends with you. Funny thing is it wasn't shared by the anime account. Huh? Slowpoke! Ooh. Hey, if we can get another world end with you, that would be amazing. <laughs> Right by. <laughs> Excuse me. Huh? Uh, um, <laughs> well, the thing is, um. You want something from me, don't you? Uh, let's just hear it then. Uh, yeah, yeah. What I'm trying to say is, um, um. Listen, whatever you're chewing, I can take it. Spit it out. I, uh, I have a favor to ask. Can you, can you please be my boyfriend? Wow. I'm already a daddy, okay? 
Niente. Say what? what? Say what? Am I hearing you right? I said, please be my boyfriend. Please, pretty please. Oh, uh, wait, wait, just like that? Your boyfriend? You mean like, you want to be a couple and go on dates? Like, what, what, the, what the hell? Yes, that's exactly it. That's what a boyfriend does. You would be my one and only B boyfriend, right? O okay, so b b back up a step or six. What the heck is with this little lady here? Just run up to me on the street the manner that I be her man? Every girl I meet these days makes me understand them less and less. I gotta get together. Can't let her know she got under my skin. I'll give her a strong answer like, don't even, don't think, even think you've won, little lady. I have no interest in women. Sorry, darling. I got no interest in women. Huh? Uh, oh, uh, okay. I mean, that's not a problem at all. But if you don't mind, could you set aside your preferences and just be my boyfriend for today? Uh, what are you talking about, girly? Darn it, I've left out a few details, haven't I? Um, I should clarify, I guess. Uh, I need you to pretend to be my boyfriend, not actually be my boyfriend. <laughs> uh, excuse me? Pretend? I, yeah, you see, my father's visiting from back home, and he's demanding to meet my boyfriend. For several years now, he's been hounding me to meet suitors he's arranged for me, and he's getting all persistent, so I finally got fed up and told him, I have a boyfriend! So back up. I also told him that my boyfriend is thin and wears an eye patch, a cool ponytail, and has a dangerous hair about him, kind of like the blade of a knife. Why would you give him so many details? And why did you describe me down to the buttons? I never thought I'd have to introduce him to my father, so I just kind of made him up as I went. But then Dad started saying, I have to see this boyfriend is worthy of marrying you. So... Here I am, and I've got a big problem. Okay, I get the picture now. So I fit the bill, so you want me to act like I'm your man in front of your dad? Wow, you catch on fast, and yeah, that's pretty much it. This is fast? <laughs> mm. If dad finds out I don't really have a boyfriend, he'll force me into arranged ma an arranged marriage with some strange man I don't even know. Please, <laughs> nobody else looks anything like you. Could you be my boyfriend just for a little while? This girl's in a pickle, all right. You can see the fork sticking right out of her. Who'd want to marry some guy they don't even know and end up being and end up spending the rest of their life with him? Fine. You painted yourself into this corner, but I feel your pain. I'll pretend to be your boyfriend. Oh, yes! I'm so glad you didn't lose hope. Uh, oh, my name is Cocoa. Uh, please call me Coco-chan. Oh, and sorry, I didn't catch your name. I'm Goro Majima. I see. Majima-san, then. I will address you as... Goro-chan. Goro-chan? We just met. That's taking things a little fast, don't you think? No, no. I know it's just pretend, but we are in a romantic relationship, so we can't be formal with each other. We have to make this believable. Uh, if you say so. Yes, I do. Well, let's not waste any more time. We should get going, like right now. I'm getting exhausted already, and what's this about going? Going where? Come on, try to keep up. We're going to the restaurant where we will meet with my father over dinner. The three of us. We're going to meet over dinner? I got nothing to say to your dad, Coco-chan. Uh, Coco so, uh, make it so we meet, shake hands, and then let me go, why don't you? Bing, mm -hmm. bang, boom. boom. Oh, no. That won't work at all. Dad won't be reassured unless I show him what kind of man my boyfriend is. We have to go now, Goro-chan. Get a move on. Damn. Damn. I don't know what I was expecting, but here we are. Here we, here we are. are. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'd hate to bug you in the middle of dinner. dinner. So, Goro-chan, this is where we'll meet my father. What do you think about that? 
First off, I guess you should tell me my blood type. My blood type's AB. Um, my star sign is Aries. I know I'm a little bit of a troublemaker, but you know what it is. Um, what's yours? Doesn't matter. I can totally tell by your aura that you're a Pisces. Anyways, so my father, he runs a business and he wants me to get married to all of his business friends. So you have to be better at business than he is. What's your favorite kind of dinner food? This restaurant's not very good. I like your eye patch. So, what are you thinking of ordering? My dad expects you to pay, by the way. You should have probably also got me a ring all the way over here, but mm, it's fine. We gotten menus yet? There's one on the table. <laughs> I'm not a Pisces. <laughs> I don't know where Clay went. I think he went to the bathroom or to get water. One of the two. Hello, Pisces speaking. I'm a Taurus. Was Clay the Pisces? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, maybe Clay's a Pisces. I almost Googled is Clay a Pisces. <laughs> if Google knew, I'm going to Google that. Is Clay a Pisces? How do you Pisces? The two rules of joining Clay. I'd like to join. If a wet clay piece is joined by a drier clay piece, the wet clay piece has more hmm, clay pieces. I spelt pieces, not Pisces. I'm a Pisces clay. You're a Pisces. I made Majima a Pisces. I only have two requests. Please don't reveal that you're just pretending to be my boyfriend, and don't anger him. You got it. But uh, what's all this about making him angry? Did I get pissed off easy? <laughs> oh no, he's just stubborn. He's not scary though. He seems to think I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed, and he babies <laughs> me more than he should. But underneath it all, he's a good father. As good a father as I could ask for. Well, I suppose it's tough to blame the guy. If I had a daughter like you, I'd be pretty worried, too. You see, so if you start by saying a bunch of weird stuff, he'll blow his lid and be like, Forget this guy! I'll arrange your next date! So, uh, let's avoid that. Uh, no problemo. So, let's go over my boyfriend's backstory now. Uh, excuse me? I need a backstory? We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist who likes going out on drives and watching movies. And your favorite food is the omelet rice that I make, okay? Uh, what was all that now? I had to give my dad some details about my boyfriend, so I made stuff up. Uh, if he gets curious, can you make sure you've got it memorized? Well, you ain't exactly making this a walk in the park. How am I supposed to remember all these details? Fine, from the top. We've been going out for like six months. You're a dentist, and you like going on drives and watching movies. You love the omelet rice that I make, okay? Okay, I'll give it my best shot. Oh, there he is. Dad, over here! So this is Coco Chan's dad. Unlike his space case of a daughter, he seems pretty buttoned up. Goro Chan, this is my father. Hello. I am Kokoa's father. Pleased to meet you. And this is the man that I'm seeing, Goro Majima-san. You know, now that I think about it, meeting a girl's dad for the first time is super important for a normal couple. This could end up making an impact on the rest of her life. Well, I guess I better buckle down and get into this role properly. No different from at the Grand, right? The first impression is the key. What do I open with? <laughs> Woo! Oh wow, this one's pretty easy. A 
I'm just gonna go with it. Pleased to meet you, sir. I am Goro Majima. Majima-kun, was it? I understand my daughter looks to you for a lot of support. Support? Oh no, it is in fact quite the opposite. Kokuo-san has stood by me at every turn. Aww. Number three? <laughs> well, how courteous of you. Something that gets to me these days is the erosion of a courtesy in today's youth. So many can't even or manage a proper introduction. You seem different, Majima-kun. That's right, Dad! Goro-chan's not like this other stereotypical man. Good. First impression went well. Playing the respectful type was a pretty slick move. Majima-kun, I must say I'm surprised. You really do exist. <laughs> oh, yep. yeah. Been there. I'm surprised that she never gave him a name. Right? I beg your pardon? Well, my daughter described you as a man who is tall yet slender waisted, sports an eye patch, and has long hair tied back, and emits a deadly aura not unlike a dagger's edge. I never imagined such a man could actually exist, yet here you are, in the flesh. See, Dad? I told you I wasn't lying. My boyfriend's right here in front of you. <laughs> yes, well, I figured he was another figment of your overactive imagination, so I'm really quite shocked. Huh? Overactive imagination? Dad, don't think make things up that I or that often, do I? I don't, do I? You just made up a word. Shut up. <laughs> 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 well, they do seem to be on good terms, and her dad's a decent guy, too. Cern, but decent. Oh, yes, Majima-kun. Kokoa may have mentioned it already, but what line of work are you in again? My job, huh? Oh man, I think Coco mentioned that backstory in the backstory she gave me. I'm a Yakuza. <laughs> Could you imagine? Oh. Man, I almost want to go off script and like tell him the truth. But if, we, if we're gonna go with it, we're gonna play this then. <sighs> I am a dentist. Oh yes, yes, that's right. I heard you were a dentist. I never would have guessed from your appearance. Not the face you'd expect from a dentist at all, to be frank. I get told that often, yes. Oh, Dad, you're being so rude to my Goro-chan. Oh, I'm just glad I remember what Kokoro, uh, Koro-chan told me. Uh, Koro? Koro. Koro-chan? Koro-chan told Koro -chan? me in that hack job of a backstory. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Koro chan outside. <laughs> you know, right? <laughs> Oh, incidentally, Majima-kun. Yes? I was wondering, how did you come to meet Kokoa? Oh, well, that's, uh... I didn't ask you. I asked Majima-kun. But... Tell me, Majima-kun, how did you two get to know each other? Ooh, time to spin a tail. What the... He's prying pretty deep. Is he on to us? Why would they put that in this? Gotta explain how I supposedly met Coco, uh, Coco Chan in a way that won't make him more suspicious. <gasps> Movie! Because we like going to we we like going to movies! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's that would be the weirdest, most unlikely thing though. Oh my god. Toast, number that's, two. That's funny. I like toast a lot. <laughs> the typical anime thing. <sighs> Domino-ne. Yeah. Toast, my lord. We happened to sit next to each other at a movie theater. <laughs> uh, that's how we met. At a movie? Come to think of it, Kokoa did mention that you enjoy movies. Yes. Uh, like I said, Coco-chan just happened to sit next to me. That flick was a real tearjerker, so I offered my ha her my handkerchief, and the rest is history. Yes, that is how it went. Amazing, Goro-chan. I can't believe you came up with such a... I, I mean, I remember it like it was 15 minutes ago. It was so romantic. 
Well, what a fortuitous meeting, then. I'm just glad she didn't meet her boyfriend any places she shouldn't, like out on the street or running with toast in her mouth. Of course not! My Goro-chan is a proper indecent man. Oh, proper indecent man. A proper indecent man, you've just described me. I wove Coco Chan's back it wove in Cho Coco Chan's backstory and came up with a tale that rings true enough. Um, Majima kun, I'm going to put it to you straight. Hey. What is it about my daughter you find attractive? Dad! Why would you put him on the spot like that? Okay, don't say her tits, don't say her tits, don't say her tits. Oh god damn it. Oh, I, I certainly love oh. her female boobs that she <laughs> yeah. has. They're certainly fun in uh, I'm, I'm to, to, to grasp during coitus. Uh, heterosexual coitus. <clears throat> Nothing is better. Uh, yeah, but for real though, she reminds me of my mother. Oh god. <laughs> Sorry, Coco. I'm even just so thinking worried about, about it. You. Makes me think that I cannot even stand up due to the erection in which I have from being attracted to your daughter. You are still so innocent, like a child. It keeps me awake at night, worrying about whether or not you'll ever manage to live a proper and prosperous family life. If there's a man who would love you and treat you well, why, I would give you my blessing for a marriage right this instant. Dad, uh... That's why I need to ask you, Majima Kun. What about Kokwa do you find attractive? He's looking into my soul here. I guess I can't blame him. His daughter's future is on the line. I don't like tricking him, but I told Kokwa chan I'd go along with this. I gotta find a good reason why I find her so attractive. Oh. Oh, oh. Abs absolutely. Perfect. Amurai. Man, I just want to see what he would say to this. I won't do it, but <laughs> he just pulls a bat out from under the table. And yeah. Like, well, there's a knock immediately at our door. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me, police bum, 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 here. Bum, 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 bum. Um, oh, she's just so cute. Come on. Oh, God, I almost it. messed it up. She makes great omelet rice. <laughs> she's <I> domestic? <laughs> I fell in love with how great the omelet rice she makes is. Oh, I must agree with you there. Her omelet rice has a special quality to it. I love it too. But Majima kun, if that's all you see in my daughter. Oh shit. Oh, three was the real answer. Three was the right answer. I don't like that three was the right answer. I Damn. thought three was the obviously wrong. If it's delicious almond rice you want, you could just easily marry a cook or go to a restaurant. Uh... Dad. Damn it. Tap into Coco Chun's backstory, uh, backstory backfire. From her dad's point of view, he'd want a guy who appreciates his daughter fully, not just for her cooking ability. Uh, oh, would you just excuse me? I need to go freshen up. Uh. Sure, honey. Don't fall in. <laughs> uh, wait a sec. With her powder in her nose, it's down to just me and her old man. Damn. Awkward. Majima kun? Yes. I have no idea who you really are, but thank you for playing along with my daughter's lie. Eh? Her lie? The jig is up. You knew all along? Uh, I guess the jig is up. <laughs> of course. I could see through you two from the moment I sat down. Oh, was it that obvious? If you knew from the start, what gave us away? I could tell just by the way my daughter was acting. I wasn't her father for all these years for nothing. Then why'd you go along with this dumb charade for so long? Hmm. Coco was so desperate to convince me. It's my fault she tried to stunt like this, isn't it? I'm sure it's because I kept pushing her into dates with all those suitors I'd arranged for her. You know your daughter well. You saw right through her. I lost my wife when Coco was still an infant. I raised her alone without anyone else's help. I tried to raise her well so that no one would look down on her for not having a mother. But I know I've been overly protective of her. I can see now that she's capable of standing on her own two feet and setting up an elaborate ruse. <laughs> I've got to stop telling my daughter to do this or that and no more pushing her to meet potential suitors. She's her own woman. It's time I learned to let go. But the truth is, there's another reason I went along with your little charade. Charade. What's that? Someday my daughter's going to bring a real boyfriend to meet me. And I thought this might be good practice. Practice, huh? Thanks to you, I've got a good idea of what to expect. When the time comes, I think I'll manage. 
but it still ain't a good feeling to spend so much time lying to someone who knew it from the start. But I gotta tell you, I think avoiding an arranged marriage wasn't the only reason Coco-chan pulled this stunt. What do you mean? I think she was trying to show you that you don't need to worry about her so much. Worry? Yeah. Pretty plain to see that she's the source of bu uh, the bundle of your worries. I think she wants to reassure you that she's capable of looking after herself. She wanted to prove to you that she can manage her own affairs, like getting married. Yeah, no, I know that innocent and childlike isn't as creepy as it seems, but I don't know. Because, like, it's, I, I would consider myself to be a little childlike in some things. You got that boy next door about you. Yeah. Where you're it's like, oh, the guy next door. Well, I, I think it also, um, like, it's like, you know, it, it could, like, I don't know if it should be, but it's considered childish a little bit to get, like, really excited about something frivolous, you know, like. Oh, yes, I forgot. <laughs> Feeling emotions in any sort of uh, uh, extreme capacity is considered to be youthful. <laughs> childish, right? Childish. Yeah. What even is? What even is reality? <laughs> But oh, you cry! What a yeah. baby! <laughs> but the reason why it seemed a little weird is because the question was framed as, "What about my daughter? Do you find attractive?" Yeah, and just to be innocent and childlike is a bit weird. Especially it was like it was like cute omelet rice or innocent and childlike. Yeah. It's a bit weird. But if it was like, oh, it's her, I don't know, like yeah. her, her childish personality. Light says carefree and optimistic. Maddie yeah, says energetic and cheerful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Carefree and optimistic. Yeah. But yeah, it was it was a combination of the way the question was phrased and the um, lack of explanation on the thing. Mm. Sorry, I'm back. I hope that wasn't too awkward for you guys. Did you even break the silence? Welcome back, Coco Chan. So, listen, your dad actually knew. I was really hoping that that. They would like say, "Okay, the jig is up. We know, but let's pull one over on her." Oh, you know, <laughs> and that's why you don't teach lessons. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, my arm! <laughs> the waiter comes to yeah. serve. And his arm falls just falls off. off. Oh. oh God. Yeah. Majima Kun. Yes. Kokoa, you've done well in finding this man. I had nothing to worry about after all. Dad. <laughs> I know, right? Goro-chan's a super guy. So this means you'll stop trying to set me up, right? Yes. I can see there's no longer any need. Really? Awesome. Oh, it's been an awfully long day. I'm heading back to my hotel, and maybe you two should too. Oh, okay. I'll walk you back, Dad. She do be a bit dense, though. <laughs> right, Phil? Goro-chan, thank you so much for being my boyfriend for even a few minutes today. Goro-chan, I think you did an excellent job pretending to be my boyfriend. <laughs> Her dad uh, is like smoking right behind them. Uh, I'm glad to hear it. I wanted to give you He's this. He's right there. Thank you. <laughs> Five pieces of fluorite. Whatever the case, <laughs> I think I'm free from my dad hounding me uh, to meet his suitors. <laughs> Oh, what a relief! Like, he's just literally right there! <laughs> That's good. Yes. Well, I have to walk my dad back to his hotel. Okay, oh. he's supposed to be. Yep. Well, when you get a real boyfriend, just, you do a better, uh, you better do a proper introduction so he doesn't have to worry about you. Hey, okay. I'll try. Bye now! I like her socks, but I don't think they go with her skirt. Oh, Coco, I, I forgot something. Just give me a moment. Oh, okay. Yeah, plaid on plaid. Yeah, it's plaid on. Huh? I think it's Argyle, uh, actually. Something wrong? Oh, yeah, it is. A oh, well, you're so fancy. Ac actually. Actually, it's Argyle. <laughs> it's Argyle. I watch some fashion shows, so I know a thing yeah. or two about Argyle. Uh, Majima Kun, there's one thing I need to say. <laughs> uh, what's that? Majima Kun, I'm glad I got to talk to you. You went through all the bother of pretending to be my daughter's boyfriend just for my sake. You're a good man. My eyes are very open. <laughs> uh, I, I was trying to put one past you. you. Don't give me too much credit now. No, no, not at all. That's why I'd like it if you'd be my daughter's real boyfriend. Also, I'm all hopped up on Mountain Dew. <laughs> He's like, that wasn't a cigarette I was smoking. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> uh, excuse me? Uh, what did you just say? 
I said, won't you please ask my daughter out for real? Consider it for a moment, please. You're obviously her type. She, you're her dream boy that she described. She actually, yeah. Dream man. What in the fresh hell makes you think that's a good idea? Because you're the ideal man. I think I can safely entrust her future to you. This is literally everyone's parents when you are gay and they don't know and you're with their daughter and they're like, marry my daughter, please. I can tell you're not a sexual threat. So please marry my daughter. <laughs> whoa, 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 slow down. I'm having trouble believing my ears. You could start by just pretending. That's fine. Heck, if she won't take you, I will. I will. Uh, did you just say what I think you did? Yeah, dad, what is all this about? Give me a break, you two. Okay, listen, listen. I know it sounds crazy, but there's this game show, okay? And then the entire premise is based on whether my daughter, you will date my daughter or me. It's very popular right now. It's called <laughs> Daddy Date or Daughter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to. Okay, sure. Yeah, I'd watch it. What channel would it be? MTV, on? call me. Absolutely. It would be, it would be MTV. It call would be me MTV. MTV. Give me a break, you two. This is why I'm single. Oh, yeah, of course. Everyone's going to believe that, Majima. This is why you're single. Be my boyfriend. Eh? Don't lie. Uh, it's my pager. You'd all watch it. I'd watch it. Some of you might have already have. Oh. Dragon, tiger, and equipment. Something must have come in. Ooh. Ooh, that guy uh, is... Looks like Faye, who's back from the... Uh, equipment <laughs> nope. <laughs> Do you see the drunk hey, he guy? Like, <laughs> stumbles <laughs> over, sees Majima. <laughs> nope. Wonder what he found. I got to swing by the dragon and tiger. I'm going to play some things. It's my birthday. Oh! oh. At least it was half an hour ago. Oh. Chugging beer, eating chocolate, and watching my favorite streamer. Oh. Happy birthday, Don't you dare play man. the air horns. I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday, <laughs> quick man. Happy birthday, I'm just kidding. For quick man, you were a little slow on your oh. birthday. <laughs> well, you were slow on playing it, so what? I guess you're I was nine now. minutes slow, not a half an hour slow. Huh. Majima answering about Coco a like Captain Holt trying to act straight. She is such a strong female woman with nice heavy breasts. <laughs> El Puffin! Thank you, El Puffin. I love Captain Holt. Greetings, friends. In this episode of Yakuza 0, Majima plays counselor to a bunch of people who should be paying for goddamn therapy. <laughs> who needs to sleep? Oh. Thank you, who needs to sleep? Thanks. Yeah, we really have been doing a, a, a job counseling the, the people, haven't we? <laughs> Also, been a hot minute since I've donated slash been in chat due to work, but I'm so happy to be able to catch a stream. Hey! Hope you've been well. I've been well. I hope yeah. you've been well as well. So well it's swell. I like this game a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Ah. I'm not stopping for you thugs. I'm stopping. <laughs> like, so weird. I knew that this game was going to be something, but I didn't expect any of this. And I'm so very glad that it is this, you know? What? What is oh, it's back, isn't it? Shit, my bad. Tempest says, also Clay, I endured Tila Tequila MTV next in Jersey Shore. I'm absolutely fine with what was it called? Daddy Date or Daughter. Daddy Date or Daughter. Like, considering they had Date My Mom, yeah. where you date someone's mom, 
and then the mom you choose the kid based on the mom oh yeah I think it's to the left of the yeah there it is Ooh. I Haneda I'm an I oh wait that's not right <laughs> I is love. I is love. I yes. means love. Visited an old run-down shopping district near Sontenbori. Managed to sneak into the store despite suspicious looks from the shoppers. Those are just real-life pictures. Dangerous temptations approached by a third party with a side deal. Resounding success. Mission went through even better than hoped. A dagger, a metal bat, steel, plastic, lead ingot, and uh, wow, iron. So much stuff. Here you receive the equipment, recipe items, and parts as assets. The equipment is immediately put for use. Recipes enable you to craft equipment, provided you have all the necessary parts to pay. Uh, discovered yet? Okay. Mm. I am. Uh, I will continue looking for more agents as well. I hope to expand our network to get even better information on powerful equipment and acquire more resourceful resources. Uh, uh, makes sense, I guess. If you got a one of the left, uh, one of got equipment, you ain't wanna gonna wanna sell it to some guy, eh? In those cases, the agents can bring back. Recipes with information on how to create a replica. I can then recreate the item in my workshop. But you need parts for that, so get parts. We have some spare ones here. You can have them for free, you lucky man. <laughs> but did you get the eggs? <laughs> They're yelling driftwood. Cursed handcuffs. It's the Flintstones. I can. Uh. Got it. Oh. Eggs? Where eggs? Oh, I'm sorry. I was so busy with the equipment search that I had forgot about shopping <sighs> again. Uh. Uh. Mm. Um, Majima san, it will take some time to make preparations for the more substantial equipment search. Uh. Hey, yeah, sure, take your time. I'll find something to do and come back later. Good luck with your eggs, bruh. Wonder how Fei Hu is the bell died. Eggs. Hmm. Once. Yeah. Is that really gonna be necessary? Ain't gotta be a genius to work out which way's the point yeah. end. Consider it a part of my service. It would be a shame to leave a fully a full power of the weapons you obtained for me untapped. Huh? I'm just saying, I got my own way of doing things, but hey, if you want to go through the trouble, I'll hear you out. I would also recommend that you work on honing your bat skills. There's a wealth of hidden information within the bat. Now you think so? I don't know, I kind of figured bad meat's head was pretty much the extent of it. Yeah. No, you have much more to learn. By my estimation, your bat technique could prove more deadly than even swordplay if you develop it. More deadly than a sword? Are you serious? So this. Quite. The bat and the katana are alike in length. They say some baseball players purchase a katana and practice their swings with them in a, uh, to heighten their focus. But, considered as another class of weapon, the bat's weight resting at the far tip yields exceptional destructive power, making it distinctively different from a blade. Uh, yeah. They're not obviously- they're obviously two different things, but the principle's not so far off, yeah? Yeah. I'm telling you! There are techniques you could perform with a bat that simply wouldn't be possible with the other weapons. I suggest you work on uncovering those. <laughs> One second, I need water. Hmm. You're making a big deal out of this, but a bat's a bat if you ask me. Uh, you just whack people with them. 
This is truly a groundbreaking technique. I will teach you a new weapon skills to busy progress, but I ask that you show me uh, your bite fighting bite bite fighting skills one more time. I'll show you anything you want, but I ain't exactly the professor type. Hey, I got an idea. What is that? Why don't you teach me a new weapon move? How about you take me on with a new weapon or that weapon? I'll fight back with the bat. It would be difficult for you to pick up new techniques that way, I fear. I believe it is better to begin learning the proper stance and forms. What? You gonna make a uh, make a pro baller start by playing catch? We ain't exactly amateurs here. I'd rather get a feel for a weapon naturally in a fight. I see. I suppose that method may be better suited to you. <laughs> I've been looking forward to going another round with you anyways. <laughs> yeah, this should be fun. Uh -huh. Ha! Perhaps it is your tr that is your true motive. Well, I will be here when you are ready to continue your training. Ooh. Wow. I'm going down. I'm yelling timber. Wow, you can actually sell these for a profit. Well, you have the infinity bat, don't you? Yeah, but this is metal bat. True. Unlimited bat works. They call me Batman. <laughs> Batman. 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 Everybody loves Batman. Batman nipples and ass. We should gotta watch Batman Forever. And Batman and Robin. Homosexual. <laughs> An English soccer stadium? Why is there hot guy picture? Oh, professional wrestler. Never seen Bat Nipples and Badass? It's from Batman and Robin? Batman Forever? One of the Batmans. They gave the bat suits bat nipples and badass. 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 Mm -hmm. <clears throat> <laughs> Manga. Did you just slap that to your torso? That's amazing. Home run sexual. <laughs> George Clooney Batman, right? Yes. Oh, right. Oh, you need to eat money. Eat money in the slugger. Oh, you are not wrong. Who needs to sleep? Yeah, that movie, that movie was made for me. Earth? Right, the shogi man. Oh, million yen money. vending machine. You don't have enough money? No. Nope. Oh, shit. Oh, 
Do we have? Oh, Kokoa has a video. I don't know if we have it. Oh shit. What kind of riddle is that, Zero? Oh my god. Nice dodge. Oh, you get the girls' videos when you clear their stories? Oh. I hope her dad's in it. You get into one fight and your beeper goes off. Seems like it. Back from his journey. My daughter! Please let my Yori go! Hey, what's all this about? Let her, uh, let her go. Your daughter is with us of her own free will. Your accusations have no merit. You people duped my daughter into joining you, you, you fanatics! If you persist in your venomous blasphemy, I'm afraid that Sister Iori will have to serve atonement for the sins of the mother. Huh? Atonement? Our adherence to pacifism makes a use of physical atonement distasteful, but it is what it is at times, uh, at times a necessary evil. Now, would you please let us be? We have vitamins and timeshares to sell. Yori, what am I going to do? Ma'am. Can't wait to get this lady's video. Right? Yori, what am I going to do? Oi. I couldn't help but overhear you giving lip to those pajama clad screwballs. Hey, something up? Oh, pardon me, and you are. Nobody special. Uh, like I said, it sounded like you were in an argument, and I wanted to make sure you weren't in any danger. So you're just passing by? You're not one of them? That that cult. Oh. Cult? Yes, those people I was talking to. Those people took my daughter, Iori. Oh, what do you mean took? So you're saying your daughter got swept up in the pajama party and hasn't come back home since? Mm. Yeah, I don't know who to turn to anymore. How old is Iori at Chan? She's 20, just a college student. 20, eh? She's ripe for the picking, then. Uh, girls her age are looking for freedom, and they must have had it on offer. But Yori isn't like that. She's been duped by those people. Uh, you sure they're a cult? Not just a bunch of kooks in pajamas? Mm. Yes, I didn't know anything was wrong until I got a call from school saying Yori is missing classes. But she left home every morning, and I followed her one day, and I saw her go into that cult building. When Yori came home, I confronted her about it. Rather than getting upset over my following her, she said, What perfect timing. You should join the order, too. Hmm. I've never seen my daughter so vacant. She gets this faraway look in her eyes whenever she talks about this new obsession of hers. I'm sure they've done something to her. She's also spending her money on those expensive amulets and statues. I told her she needs to get out of this cult. But she ain't exactly listening to reason, is she? Right. The next day, the cultists just showed up and took my daughter away. They didn't even resort to force, but they weren't going to let her going to leave without her either. <sighs> I got you. I've gotten to see the main ties pleading to see my Iori, but they always turn me away at the door. I just recently lost my husband to a different cult. <laughs> if I were to lose my poor daughter now. Her daughter's caught up in some sort of weird cult and she ain't even seen her. That ain't right. Oh no. Um, Majima, was it? May I please make a request? Yeah, go for it. I guess I kind of stepped into this one anyways. If it's something reasonable, uh, maybe I can help. Um... Would you mind killing them all? I mean, join the cult for them for me? Yep. Hey, you want me to join them? Well, what part of that is reasonable? Well, I only disciples are allowed inside, and joining them is the only way to get in. I would sneak in myself, but they know my face now. They would never let me pass the doors. I get it. And since they don't know me, I can join them and gain entry with no fuss. Uh, it sounds logic, but... You must think I'm insane for asking you to do this, but we've only just met, and I, I want my daughter back. Majima-san, please, please help me. I will, of course, provide you with a reward of some sort. If you could even just tell Yori that I wanted to come home, even that will do, please. Oh, 
Can't say no now. Oh, uh, can't very well say no now, now can I? Mm, you're but, right, Riley. If you can't beat them, join them, and then beat them. Uh, but all I can promise is that we uh, that I'll tell her to come home. Oh, you will? Oh, thank you. Majima-san, please be careful. There's no telling what the order of the Moonan Chohap John uh, what? The Moonan Chohap Onast. That is feels like anagrams. And chat says that this is this is prime meme real estate. Okay. So meme away. Moon on moon cha -cha. Cha -cha -cha. What now? The order of the moon on Chohap Onast. You must learn their name. If you can't even get that much right, those cultists will never trust you. Uh, right. Uh, odd name for a religion, though. <laughs> anyway, don't you worry. I got this. I'll snake my way in, make contact with the Ori-chan, and then I'll snake my way out. Thank you. Please take this, Majima-san. <laughs> that was the best taking of anything. Oh, a handmade amulet. What's this? What is this? The charm made a ward off evil. I think you may need it, Majima-san, for protection. <laughs> I hope it really works. Please find my daughter, Iori. Oh, he did figure it out. No! Huh? Those pajama freaks are in that cult that Yori-chan's joined. I gotta join him and help out her mom. Hi! Excuse me. Yes, do you seek something from us? It's me, Yori-chan. I gotta get into this cult. So first, I gotta act like I really wanna join. I'm here for the Chapo Ched Dipped Orst. No. I want to join the order of Macho Ched Dipped Orst. Mm -hmm. Macho Ched Dipped Orst, I'm afraid that's not us. Uh, <clears throat> is that right? Yep. Whichever path you seek, it is not the one we walk. May the light of divine benevolence illuminate your path. Huh. That's kind of cute. Damn. What was the name of the pajama bride again? <laughs> Safe. How do you do, fellow cultists? Ooh. Interesting. An actual good thing. Oh, wow. I guess it'll do better than this manga. <laughs> better than taping comics to your body. Hi, excuse me. the pooch once already so nothing's gonna sound natural at this point so I gotta go balls out <clears throat> uh hey, yeah I want to join your order of Moran Cho hacked autones hmm. didn't you say a different name last time either way that's not our faith oh uh, you sure about that yes whatever path you seek is not ours damn I'm getting hella confused here Hi! <laughs> Excuse me. These are actually different. The macho one's not here. Yeah. That's funny. Titties. Chat. Meme. Also chat. Don't meme too much. <laughs> uh, yeah. I want to join your order of Moon and Chohept Onstat? On, on, on ass? Oh, is that so? Are you sure you wish to commit to becoming a disciple of the order of Moon and Chohept Onest? Yeah. Uh, yeah, exactly. I think you Moon mm -hmm. and Chohept guys can steer me in the right direction in these crazy times. Oh, I see. Come with me if you would. Uh, sure. Oh. I was a little shaky there, but I'm you bet I'm getting in. You guys might be suspecting something though. Thank you for committing yourself to our path. May I have your name and little aim, please? Uh, I'm Majima. Koro Majima. Ah, Brother Majima. Unasked for informing me. Now, let's have you Whoa, hold up a sec. 
Uh, you just threw that psycho babble at me like I was supposed to know what it meant? Oh, honest is a word we use to express the feeling of gratitude and appreciation. Uh, we already have a word for that, but honest to you too, buddy. I was going to say, Brother Majima, we will have you observe a portion of our activities today. You must observe with purpose. It is the first part of your training to absorb our doctrine. There will be a test at the end as a measure of your faith. At least it ain't a pop quiz. <laughs> uh, gotcha. Well, shall we be... Help! Oh, help me! Please help! <gasps> oh, no! Hey, oh, what's all the racket? Apologies, brother. He is a debaser. Oh, not again. We must gotta be more careful. We have a new recruit with us here today. Yes, I will call for chastening. Eh? Chastening? Like with the belt? No! Not that! Not a chastening! Have mercy! Let my willy go free! Oh, 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 hold up. That guy's scared shitless. I don't know what's going on, but maybe you could ease up on him? <laughs> oh, your concerns are unfounded, Brother Majima. That poor soul is racked by episodic outbursts of manic behavior. <laughs> outbursts, eh? Come this way. No! I want to go home! Oh, please, pay no heed. Let us continue. Whoa, what do we got here? Chew the pee pee, chew the pee pee, chew the pee pee, chew the pee pee, chew the pee pee. This is our prayer room. This is where we practice the chew the pee pee. Uh, hold up. You slipped that <laughs> sure a pee pee thing in as if it was the most natural thing in the world. Uh, what is it? Ah, but it is. Shura PP is training to attain higher enlightenment in the path of the moon and show hip honest. Okay. Shura PP is training. Those engaged in Shura PP have the latest recruits. As a collective, we refer to each other as friends. Latest recruits, eh? That lady's lost daughter, Yori Chan, could be doing this Shura PP thing right here. We didn't ask what she looked like. Sure, a pee pee gives. She was the one who was being toted around by her, I believe. Was it? I just thought that was a lady. Oh, maybe it was just a lady. It yeah, could have been. You her might though. be right. I, I was. Yeah. Sure, a pee pee gives them focus. Through concentration, they accumulate coolie paws. DKP? 50 DKP minus. You guys got a dictionary for all this? What's coolie pass? Well. To put it in layman's terms, you it can be considered a measure of virtue. As we accumulate coolie pies, the divine moon and show up shall bestow enlightenment and rapture upon us. Uh-huh. Uh, this is getting so old so fast. Oh, Sister Yori, you must sway more. Proper sure a pee pee is the light into path to enlightenment. Everyone knows the base of sure to pee pee is in one's hips. Oh. Yeah, yes, honest for your benevolent guidance. Yes, pee pee harder. Your sure day's fine. You just call your, her Yori? Is that our girl? Damn. Hey, 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 huh? I'm sorry, I need a minute to help steer our friends towards the path of the just, Brother Majima. Please feel free to observe. Should Don't mind if I do. Here's my chance to see if that friend is our girl, Yori-chan. Should I pee-pee? Should I pee-pee? Should I pee-pee? Holy shit. Oh, wait, no. This is stage. It's not a mirror. You thought they were vampires? I thought they might be vampires. You thought we were his vampire? Maybe M Majima's vampire. My name <laughs> is Majima. I am your new god. Should it pee pee me? Good. Good. Yes. Our girl Yuri do be off though. Oh no, she's kind of off. A little off. Oh, she's a little weak. No. 
Hey, sister. Sister, uh, that guy called you Iori, right? <sighs> Ignore me, huh? Guess she wants to concentrate on her sure peepee -pee thing. But I gotta see if this girl's really Iori chan. What do I say to her? People can't help laughing when it's most inappropriate. I'll give her a Sotenbori side splitter to open her up. Uh, want to avoid dangerous cults? <laughs> Just practice safe sex! <laughs> <laughs> eh? That's really good. That's really good. Eh? <sighs> oh, come on! Even I'm dying at that one! I'm blinking back the tears here! <laughs> Claim to be Moon and Chohep. Chohep. <clears throat> Maybe if I name drop their god, she'll be open to listening. Alright, worth a try. Moon and Chohept. I am mortal. I come bearing grave tidings. Ah! What blasphemy! How dare you take the blessed name of our master, the great Moon and Chohep? Oh, she got totally steamed. Still. Ah, finally got your attention. So, you're Yuri chan, ain't you? What? How'd you know my name? Bam! This girl is that lady's missing daughter. Yuri chan, listen up. I got a message from your mom. My mom? Yeah. Uh, why is her head so pointy? She asked me to get in here and tell you to come home. Ma the mother. 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 Great mother, great. Ah. Uh. Yori chan? Ah, ah, mother. Ah, my head hurts. Ah, ah. Hey, 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 what's wrong? Snap out of it. Ah. Brother Majima, what's going on here? You must not disturb our disciples and shoot a pee pee. Uh, yeah, S sorry, uh, my bad. Sister Yori san, are you well? Mm. Yes, I think so. Brother Majima, please be careful when speaking to fellow disciples. Our friends are purging memories of family and their worldly desires to attain spiritual purity. Say what? Purging memories? Yes, through the Shura Pee Pee. Yes, as a rule, our disciple pulls undergo a mental cleansing process so that they may better dedicate themselves to Shura Pee Pee. B -b but that's... <laughs> well, my friends, I ask for your attention. Uh... Ah, ah, ah. Today, our guru has come to inspire us in our climb towards ever higher states of enlightenment through Shura Pee Pee. Uh, ooh. Friends, our spiritual leader, Guru Monen Suzuki. Uh, Please, I can't do any more. My disciples, <laughs> Munacho. <laughs> I love him. Munacho. Yeah. Do you too, brother Majima? Huh? Wait, the hell's Munacho? Munacho is our word of greeting. Incidentally, our word for farewell is. Hepton, Brother Majima, please. Monancho. Monancho. One demerit. Huh? Okay. Glory be a most splendid greeting. Our savior and master, Moon and Chohep, is most pleased. Ooh. Ooh. I had no idea it was physically possible to beat this <laughs> phony. This is actually kind of impressive. So, friends, tell me, 
how much titherance have you all contributed to the exalted Moon and Shohep? I have contributed five Rincho! I have done better at eight Rincho! Rish! Oh shit, sorry. Pun! Titherance is what we call a teeth. Uh, okay. I was just about to ask that. So, how much is a rincho worth? One rincho is 100,000 yen. 100,000 yen? These disciples are kicking up that much to, to, to the uh, order? It is all a process to a greater enlightenment and joy. When one is bound by chains of gold, there can be no freedom. Renouncing your possessions is the first step to rapture. No matter how phony it is, I thought it'd be okay if it made people feel better, but damn. They're just straight up stealing from these suckers. Ah, <laughs> uh, so much titherance. Glory be. Onast, my friends. Oh? Sister Iori-san, was it? You appear somewhat pale. Are you feeling quite well? Hi! Yes, I'm fine. Onast for your concern, Guru. Yes! Incidentally, Iori-san, how much titherance have you tended towards your enlightenment? I, I haven't been able to put together enough money yet. What? A false friend? Such a shameful lack of faith! <sighs> I beg your forgiveness. Shame. But friends, do not chastise our sister, Iori-san. We all have worldly excuses that weigh us down. Guru Moon and Suzuki. <sighs> you must understand, Titherance is an especially valued form of Shure Pipi. If you are alone in lacking Rin Rincho, Sister Iori-san, your Kulipas will be stunted. Oh, not her Kulipas. Oh no! What can I do? Uh, Titherance is a donation. Shure Pipi is some kind of a meditation. And Kulipas is what now? God damn it, I can barely keep any of this gibber straight. Sister Iori-san, I am happy to observe that you are blessed with divine physicality and transcendental beauty. Engaging in special shure pipi with me can put things to right. Gross. Special shure pipi? Guru, it's an honor. Hey, Nanny. Yeah? The special shure pipi after stream? <laughs> Only oh. if you have the titherance for it. Oh. What? I'm doing it because you don't have the titherance. Oh. Well, then I'll make it up to you. I'll tither twice as hard. No, no. Just the special shirt of pee -pee's. Okay. Uh, I'll show your pee-pee twice as hard then. Oh, wow. <laughs> the most sacred form of shirt of pee, pee It bestows enormous coolipas. <gasps> we shall experience it together shortly. Go and cleanse your body of impurities. Rapture awaits. Fuck. Like, have obviously. Have ever washed and sent to my room? <laughs> yeah. Have a bathed and sent to my room? Right? That is gross. Gross! Yeah, like, obviously it's gross, but all those silly words make it very odd. Comedic! Yeah, comedic. Let's go to a bar. Hey, baby, you want to do some uh, sacred shoulda pee pee? I'll bestow upon you my enormous coolie pus. <laughs> <laughs> I shall, Guru. Hept on, friends. Please continue with your shure pee pee. Honest. And he turned around because he doesn't want you to see his boner. The and only his thing pants. shure is pee pee. Uh, oh, where's your chan gone to? I know not the details, but it is among the most sacred of Shura Pipi that the disciple becomes as one body and soul with our guru. I don't know why I was doing that. Like, unironically, this is the thing that happens, oh. <laughs> which is oh. like Gross. so weird. Yeah. If you were in a situation like this, say no, get out, put an eye patch on, punch people in the face. Get a bat, find a girl, give her dolls, 
Find a girl. Pretend to be her boyfriend. Let her call you daddy. Let her call you daddy. Not but my. Uh, uh, uh. Become as one, eh? <laughs> like I said, I thought about that woman you met on the bus. Hey, she didn't want to show her pee pee. She just wanted me to retire at 30. But she was too late. I was already 30. Oh, it is a special sure to pee pee allowed only to women, <laughs> and even among them, only the chosen. Oh, if I were not a man, I wish I could partake in its grand glory. This bogus guru is not only saving him money, but he's got his pick of the girls. How does these pajama twits not get wise to this scam? It is weird. Her mom only wanted her to get the a message, immediate message to a yard chan. So I'm technically done with that part, or what I promised to do. But now Yori Chan's in real danger, so screw it. I'm extending my membership. <laughs> I would just hate to be that guy and just like watching Majima go through all these like blatant emotions on his face as he'd like head. <laughs> yeah, just. Uh, 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 uh. Your tour is over, brother Majima. It is now time for your test. My test? Uh, hold your damn horses, I ain't got time right now. Are you sure? By demonstrating, you have <laughs> learned of our ways of the order, you may earn a blessing in person from the guru. What do they feed you here, man? That was disgusting. I uh, say what? You mean I can meet the old guru if I do good on your test? <laughs> You're on then. Very well. It'll be a simple oral exam, <laughs> a quiz if you will, to determine how attentive you were during your tour. Yeah, for sure. I'm sorry, I'm just really into character, guys. Come on. It's called method acting, and if you guys were actors like myself and Clay here- That's it! 30 short of peepees from all of you! Short of peepees, chat! If I don't see you, do it 30 times in chat. <laughs> the shirt of pee pee monster will come after you. No, not the shirt of pee pee monster. It's big pee pee. Big pee pee. Big pee pee. Uh oh. Oh my god. If you do enough shirt of pee pee, can we measure your pee pees? Hmm. I guess you do measure your pee pees. Your shirt of pee pees. So. Mm. That shirt of pee pee. And Kura, if I've ever seen one. Pass is a measurement of pee pee. Kuri pass, yes. The first question then, in the order of the moon and show hit on asked, what do we say to express our gratitude? <laughs> Are we still allowed? Molte grazie. Are we still allowed to meme? Are we allowed to meme with your massive pee pee monster? I'm gonna play a thing. Sure. Make sure to be safe when you show your pee pee. <laughs> Cyber Saiyan! Meme? Yes? Frick yeah, meme! Meme all the way! Yeah, do what you like then, friend. Do what you like, cause, uh, Majima's free. You are Majima. Molte grazie! Molte grazie! Incorrect! How disappointing! Isn't that some kind of foreign language? The correct answer is honest. You must know this. Right, well, honest for setting me straight. Your second question What do we call the training we undergo to accumulate coolie paws? I wish I had puppy. Shoot a popo. Shoot a papu. Shoot a papu. Uh, close, but no. Uh, the correct term is shoot a pee pee. Were you paying attention at all? Uh, yeah, I I was, but not enough, I guess. The third question, Moon An Cho is the greeting of the order of the Moon and Cho Hept on us. Please demonstrate it. <laughs> Oh my god. Do the hustle. Do the hustle. Pa 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 da pa da pa 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 da pa da 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 Uh, 
Oh, yeah. That looks familiar. Very well. The final question. Do you remember the name of our guru? Moon and Tanaka. Yeah, Tanaka. I think Tanaka and Sato are like two really common names. Moon and Tanaka, right? No. Our leader is Guru Moon Suzuki. Oh, damn, sorry. Uh, he's got kind of a common name. And with that, we are done. Your test is at an end. Uh, Brother Majima, what exactly were you observing on your tour? You seem to remember nothing from it. Well, I can't be expected to remember everything. Uh, my bad. Brother Majima, I'm sorry, but your lack of faith is... I find your lack of faith disturbing. You are not worthy of seeing our guru. Aw, oh, man, but seeing him would make me real devoted. Come on. Unacceptable! Aw, oh, pretty please. Give me a chance. No means no. Huh? I asked nice. Now I'm going to put a sh 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 schism. Oh, my ears are ringing. Schism on your face. Yeah, that was a loud noise you made, wasn't it? Uh, friends, aid me. Those death to reason must be chastened. Friends, do what you must. Hit them. Oh, what the fuck? Chill, oh God. Beating up members live on stream. Thank you for your support. Whoa, he just did a butterfly. I was getting trouble trying to do these heat actions. Oh, 100%. We could have avoided this if we uh, answered correctly. Oh, 100%. I can't believe they're still shooting their pee pee as well as this is happening. Shoot a pee pee. I gotta play some things. I don't know, guys. This Q-Lipears thing sounds a lot like waffles. Well, well, f f Farak, what? Friends! Friends! I assure you, they are very different. They are very different. different friends. Yeah, first of all, we don't call each other friends. We call each other members. Please, have some waffles and forget. And our god is not some loser like Moonen Car brand. It's Kiryu. Had enough? Then take me to your guru. If not, I'm open to more negotiating. Oh, please. No more. Just follow me. I hope Yori-chan's still okay. Show your pee pee. Show your pee pee. Wait, what? Guru Moonen Suzuki? Please excuse us. I hope no special Shura pee pee is happening in here. Ah, is that our new friend candidate? What was it now? It's Brother Majima. Uh, pleased to meet you. <sighs> Brother Majima uh, has um, some some issues, but is truly motivated. Uh, guru, uh, can he benefit from the special shooter pee pee? I see. That is music to my ears. I have matters I must attend to, so let us not waste any time. There. You have my blessing. Oh. I felt it. I felt it, too. Did you feel it? Whoa, did you just give me some Peter's hard wood? You've given us some wood now, baby. We got wood now. Hey, you call this stuff your blessing? Mm -hmm. Is there a problem? No, I suppose not. Guru, excuse me. Ah, uh, Iori-san. Have you readied yourself for Shura Pipi? No, just the Pipi. Hey! Yes, Guru, I have cleansed myself thoroughly. I am a vessel for... Oh, your special Shura Pipi. Excellent. 
since I already performed your benediction. Both of you should leave at once. Hepton. All right, end of the road. <sighs> If I don't stop this now, this sure of Peepee's pissin's gonna have his way with his with the Orichan. With me instead. Yorich oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh no! Not what oh, I was expecting! Damn it! Oh! I thought it was with the guy. Me too! <sighs> Yorichan. Forget this granola guru. <laughs> How about you just short pee pee with me instead? <laughs> Oops. I beg your pardon? Would short a pee pee with you add to my coolie boss? <laughs> uh, it, it might not do anything for your coolie boss, but. <laughs> then there is no need. Brother Majima, what is the meaning of this outburst? Exit my chamber at once, sir! Oh, what was I thinking? That made me sound just like this guru goon. Yeah. I am Moon and Chohept. I am Moon and Chohept, mortal. Hear me, Yori Chan. Flee. Flee at once for your home. Huh? How dare you? You must never take Moon and Chohept's name in jest. Brother Majima, that is utter blasphemy. You spit in the face of our divinity. Who has put you up to this? Oh, please forgive me. Majima-san, you will be doomed to eternal damnation. Uh, invoking the big man's name sure gets people riled up around here. Uh, so what's my plan? Your mom's gonna be heartbroken. Yori-chan, you're being conned. Your mom's gonna be heartbroken. Mom? <laughs> Who is mom? My head, ah, oh, it hurts. You can't forget your mom, Iori-chan. They might have messed with your memory, but you gotta remember the woman who raised you. Stop it, Majima-san. Awakening the memories of friends is a sin beyond all sins. Shut your face, you damn phony. Iori-chan, snap out of it. I'll take you home to your mom. <gasps> what? What is up? Mom, 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 This. It's my mother's amulet. Yorichan, do you remember now? Uh, I don't know. But why did I ever think I wanted to become one with this shady old hippie? You're thinking straight now, at least. Uh, this woman was ripened. Uh. Mine for the picking! Lucky. How dare you interfere! Oh, Guru Moon and Suzuki! Ah, uh, see? There's your snake oil shilling fraud showing his true colors. Guru Pajama Pants has been milking all of you. Silence! Menacing man. Oh my god, yes. Wow, slippery one. Hit him with a chair. Oh. He's actually good at fighting. He's doing some capoeira. Well, I'm gonna do some couch away to. <laughs> wow, he is loaded. He, that's the coolie buzz at work. And the titherance. Oh, wow, that was cool. And the palm and the reach. Are we gonna learn how to fight like him, I wonder? I hope so. Oh, shit. Shit. Take that charity work. <laughs> nice. Oh, hey, come on. Oh, oh, that is it. Like honestly, those are some Tekken moves. I've I, I've seen them in action. This song is good. 
I'm gonna play some things. Are so killing pars are like waffles. Wait a minute. That guy, you are sorely mistaken, friend, but that is okay. All in time, soon. Oh, we'll did my bat reveals. break? I guess my bat broke. Your metal bat? Yeah. You only have uh, 30 uses. Infinity bat. Daddy Machima in a short chat's PP a mirite. <laughs> JC! I wish. Wait, oh, I thought there was a mark on that window like you can throw him out there, but it's just a mark on the window. Yeah, Eddie Gordo. He does Capoeira. I joined at the wrong time. Or at the right time, Pecatronics. It all depends on your outlook. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is just Eddie Gordo. He's Eddie Gordo. Uh-oh. 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 You think this guy to be so tough? It's from all that special short of pee-pee he's been doing. <sighs> I think we have to table this discussion. <laughs> oh, oh my god. You were such an asshole. Like a guard breaky style. He breaks her guard like hella easy. Shoof! Would have liked to do it with more style, but whatever. Oh, ow! Such pain! Ooh! Ooh! How many broken bones do I have? Ooh! Ooh! Guru, we heard terrible noises. Is everything all right? Friends, ooh, quickly, ooh, you must call me an ambulance. Oh, oh, our, oh. our guru is gravely injured. Oh. We must perform the ritual of healing for him, everyone. Move on. Oh, no, you dipshits. Oh, oh, waving your hands isn't going to fix anything. Oh, <laughs> Is he already doing it too? No, she's behind us. Oh, good. Ooh, somebody help me. Uh, <coughs> I was like that too, wasn't I? Uh, you're Jen. We should get you home. Right. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> hey, Ari. Mom, are you done with that crazy religion? Mm. Yes, I'm over it. Mom, I I wanted to bring Dad back. What? Ever since Dad died, you haven't stopped crying. But there was nothing I could do for you. And that's when they told me the dead could be brought back to life. I just had to do these rituals and earn a few spirit points. I should have known how insane it was. I guess I just got caught up in that cult scam. So that's why. But I know now that if I followed those terrible people, I'd be leaving you all alone. And that's even worse. So I'm sorry. No. I should be the one saying sorry, Ori. I didn't know how much anguish I was causing you. I'm so sorry. Thank you, Majima-san. I only asked you to deliver a message, but you got my daughter back. I can never thank you enough. <laughs> uh, no problem at all. I'd say I got pretty spirit, a pretty spiritual experience out of it too. Now, right, do the hustle. All three of them doing the hustle at the end of this would be the best way. It would be the best way to end this. Ajimasat, please take this as our thanks. It seems hardly of any value for all that you've done for us, though. Traveler's amulet. Yeah. Oh, right, Yori-chan, I gotta give this to you. You handed over the hand of that. This is 
just mothers. <laughs> the amulet totally worked, you know. After all, you got some free pajamas out of it, Yori Chan. Oh. If you hold on to that amulet and let it protect you, you and your mom, uh, protect you and your mom, uh, keep the family together, will you? Hey, I will. Majipa san? Hmm? What's up? Thank you. You saved us. <laughs> it's all good. Yay! Now finally, what I get to use the dream machine. unexpectedly amazing side quest. Yeah. And just remember, chat, with enough waffles, you too can achieve any of and all of your dreams. You got a turtle? Maybe. I like turtles. Remember, chat, always strive to achieve PPS. Mm. Mm hmm Yep. Oh. Remember, chat. Remembering is remembering. Never forget, chat. Yep, never forget. Oh! I think I'm being possessed by our god. Kaluis PPS. Uh, 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 Nuts, uh, That was an interesting song you sung. Uh, it's inside of me. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Possessed. That's remember, chat, never forget. Ne remember, chat, never forget. Always wear headphones as soon as the Nyan Cave goes live. Kaluie pee pee ass. Come on, get with it. If you provide us with enough pee pee, you may uh, taste the sacred dragon milk. Oh, is it that easy? Yeah, it's that easy. I had no idea. I don't know. Where do I sign up and how do I do more? Right here. <laughs> oh, please. Do you like that? I did. Yeah, take that. Yep. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, take that. Yeah. Kuzu. But you are. Yeah, that's right. Open your mouth. Uh, ah, mm. yeah, that's right. What was it? Delicious. It was my coolie pus. Your coolie pus? My coolie pus. Eat my coolie pus. You can, everyone can see through that, Clay. Why are you no taking your clothes through. off, Clay? Is this part of the shuri pee pee? Who needs to sleep? Who needs to sleep? <laughs> King Neo, good stream, everyone, good stream. Yeah, we did it. This was a wholesome and a oh, do the hustle. Oh, that was so good. How did you get back there? You were just over there. Is that the magic of the coolie pee pee? Yep. Wow. To the rinse. I think, I think uh, once you collect enough coolie pee pee, you get the biggie pee pee. Hmm. You know what this Ooh. is for, you filthy degenerates. Raiga! This donation has temporarily been disabled until the world is less messed up. Thank you, Raiga! I know. Do the hustle! Da, 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 da. I'm gonna get you the cut out with the Nanako. Da, 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 da. Thank you, the Raiga. Da, 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 da. It is the Raiga. R I. Biggie pee pee, Raiga. Biggie pee pee. Raiga. Do you wanna put this on the board? The biggie pee pee? The Raga one. It would be my honor. Okay. I put it around the side. Oh, you can see me on camera! Hi! Ow! Oh. Uh. I need a puppet. I need a puppet. I need a puppet. I need a puppet to come around here so I can make puppet mouth with my hands. Biggie pee pee tasty milkies. Well, I don't e I don't even know what else to say. Exocalibur to all. And to all a good Zuda. 
to all a good Zura. Zura. Okay, bye. Bye. Thank you. I love you. Bye. Bye. They say those who say the A word in chat reach enlightenment. Oh.